Hey, Mr. Clash, and today I'm going to tell you why I despise, hate, loathe, cannot stand anything about Builder Base. And this video is going to sum it up. It's AI, Troop AI. I'm going to show you three attacks out of the last four where the AI is just ridiculous, idiotic makes no sense and which is why I really can't even be bothered with the game. Normally I wouldn't even take a minute to do an attack. Normally I would just spray my archers all around the base, drop the hero and that's it. Okay, so here we go. Just have a look at what's left here at the moment. Okay, so from this angle we've got an archer, air defense, balloon defense, whatever. Uh, Gold storage, a camp and a crusher. So just going to keep an eye on how things pan out for the moment. A couple arches down. I've got 15 arches left. Okay, so you can see this gold storage is just about down. So let's zoom in here now. A bit of a zoom in. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. Alrighty, let's have a look. And Almost, almost, stop. Okay, this was the tile right here. Now I dropped more than one because I wanted it to go to the archer. And of course we know that when I do my little magic line drawing that you've seen me do in the game about midway, right, that's why I reckon dropping the troops there, really they should have gone to the archer in my opinion. Okay, but maybe the game's got different AI priorities. So let's just have a look what happens next. Did you see that? These archers dropped here are going to target onto this. How on earth is this deemed the closest thing to these archers? They've got to go past the camp, the archer tower, to get to this thing. So, okay. <laughs> That's just exercise in frustration. Obviously, they could take out this archer tower. Look where the next ones are dropping. Over here. Okay, these ones are dropping right here. You can still see the little circle. So there's no doubt about where they're getting dropped here. We do the magic line from center to center. We come out perpendicular, right? No way is this thing closer. No way. These archers are, again, going to bypass this archer tower and go straight to this thing. So you wonder why I don't like the game. If you cannot even predict the most simple AI like this, then how can you really predict or plan anything? You can't. You can't. It, it, it's just the, the whole game is idiotic. Let's have a look at another example. Okay, next example. Let's kick this off. Firstly, we're going to watch this archer tower up here and the archer that I place onto this lab. Just get the archer placed so we don't have to watch it all. Okay, let's have a zoom in on that. Outside of the range. Oh, look, I guess not. I guess this archer tower must actually have an additional range, not just that range. Okay, so... Next, we're going to have a look at the hero AI. Just speed this up, get the hero down. Okay, so 30 seconds left. The hero's almost got this, decides to walk over. Finally, I don't know what it, what the hero was doing, why he changed his mind. Now watch where he retargets. What's he going? What's he going? Uh, okay, he walked past the Tesla to hit the Tesla. He's walked past the Tesla to hit the Tesla, but he had to walk past the double cannon first to hit the Tesla. Now the Tesla, if draw a straight line between these two, any of these are far closer than the Tesla. The most idiotic AI. Now watch the archers. I've only got 18 seconds left on this attack. Four archers. Watch what I do with them. Okay. Now we're going to see something interesting. All right. One's gone over here. Three look like they're heading this way. 
Let's watch. And look at that. One is targeting this, and the three were obviously targeting this. This is further than this. It doesn't matter how you cut it. This is further away than this. What's the result? The result is I've lost two arches to a spring, and basically, I'm not going to get this down. Otherwise, I would have got it down, right? Would have got higher percentage. Let's have a look at another one. All right, this is the last one I'm going to show you. It just, <laughs> it just happens just about in every attack. There's some retarded AI or something that goes on. So the first one we're going to have a look at, first couple here, is watch what happens to the arches I drop on this archer tower. Watch what they target after this archer tower goes down. Just speed that up a little bit. And there we go. Okay, all three archers standing in the one spot. Watch carefully where they go. Two, okay, two have gone to that. And this one is now targeting the lab. The lab, the labs, yeah, okay. Words fail me. Words seriously fail me here. Now I'll have a look at the rest of these archers. And where are they all going? Okay, great. Now let's have a look at the next two that I drop. I want to drop them on this cannon because this cannon looks like it's going to go down. Great, same spot. They stand on top of each other. Watch where they go next. <laughs> one over to this and one to the archer tower. Oh, goodness gracious. The, the AI is absolutely insane. Okay, next one. Watch the remaining archers I'm going to drop here. They all dropped here on this spot, but they didn't all target the same thing. They dropped on the same spot, even if you follow a line over here. Everything above this line should go to that thing there. That's the logic of, of the AI, right? In this case, no. So do you wonder why I despise Builder Base? And the only reason I'm actually in Builder Base is so I can get clan games uh, points. That's the only reason. It's the only reason I go into build a base. I don't get a single ounce of enjoyment out of build a base. It just sucks. The, ma the matchmaking is usually dreadful. <laughs> usually I'm facing things that have more weapons, bigger troops, the, the whole thing. I know people say, oh, it's based on trophies and things like that. If you can't even get this simple matchmaking right, there's just no fun in getting mismatched. It's the same reason I don't play Clash Royal. Uh, I have no control over the match. I don't, can't even get an even match, so I really can't be bothered. And then when you throw this idiotic AI into it that you've seen, it just basically ruins the entire thing for me. So we're going to come to the question of the day, and we do have to have a question of the day. Even though I'm showing some very sad things, I do want to finish off with a light-hearted question of the day. And that is... What tea do soccer players drink when their game ends in a draw? What tea do soccer players drink when their game ends in a draw? <laughs> they drink penalty. <laughs> a penalty, penalty shootout. Anyway, that's it for today. Look, do, I am curious. What do you think of Builder Base? Do please let me know. I call it Suck World because it sucks. <laughs> Everyone in the clan knows I call it Suck World. Um, if you've got a different pet name for it, do let me know. Leave the video a thumb up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next video.